Good morning everyone. I am welcome you all to this 27th day of CSA or online class. Today we are going to discuss about unit 10. Uh, before I enter into the session, please let me know am I audible? Can you see my slides? Please, uh, uh, am I audible? Can you see my slides? Please respond in chat box. Yeah, okay. Thank you for your response. Now we start the session. Uh, I'm uh, divided the uh, unit 10 into two parts because it's too long, big, big concept quads uh, and also it's a very important uh, uh, each and every steps are very important so i am divided into two classes um, yesterday i was uh, uh, di discussed the uh, remaining session the unit uh, nine, uh, nine in in uh, session three okay in this session we have two important units uh, it's uh, in that the tenth unit is very important so, uh, it's a uh, ecological a, a based one uh, we some some may know about the this concept this ecological principles uh, competitors predators that concept apart from uh, some uh, uh, in that you in this unit we can expect what kind of interaction between uh, two animals what kind of interaction between two birds plant and animals that kind of questions in ecological principle we have different uh, topics and we different interactions because the ecology system is related uh, with the plant animal birds all of them interlinked so in this unit we are going to discuss about the ecological principle okay first is a physical environment what is the physical environment it's a external environment it's non-living ex in environment it is called as the uh, physical environment in this physical environment we can uh, can we can uh, discuss the the sun heat then uh, the wind salt rate in uh, water and uh, salt rate in land soil minerals all those things comes under the physical environment why we need it physical environment this is the very abundance of uh, it's limit the abundance of plant and animals okay some temperature it's uh, some period uh, plants are uh, effectively grown in some period alone uh, animals are uh, they effectively producing uh, some uh, the secondary uh, their metabolites and uh, they are active in some uh, particular in uh, the period okay that all things are uh, this physical variables okay all this physical variables limit the abundance of animal and uh, plants the plant uh, plant uh, in plant uh, some plants are uh, uh, flowering in higher temperature uh, nature that kind of things and in, in the physical factor we can uh, it's limiting species okay uh, it's uh, that factors are extreme temperature that extreme temperature that there, uh, there is uh, no plant and animal uh, um, survivals so that does that make a limiting the species uh, like uh, sahara and uh, some extreme temperature it may be high it may be low in uh, in jammu and kashmir and himalayas there was some uh, less amount of plants only there some uh, animals small quantity of animal animals alone we can survey in the extreme temperatures extreme means it may be low it may be high uh, it's extremely low or it may be extremely high and wind uh, in the wind means uh, if there is uh, open space okay there is a higher wind right if there is open space means there is a no habitat for 
the animal and uh, the species so there was some uh, defect in the wind uh, based on the wind uh, that if there is a wind a higher wind rate means uh, we, the birds cannot be survive in the particular place so all those things are considerable in the physical factors then salt uh, salinity of the water is a major factor because uh, uh, in the salt salt content higher region the salt content higher water ponds are not suitable for the habitat of the uh, that uh, suitable for uh, survive, uh, survival factor because uh, the animals system also similar to our human system it's having kidney it having livers all those things are damaged due to the higher salinity the salt is also very important then global climate change uh, we are all know about the polar bears uh, that some kind of species only live in the one particular climate alone if there is climate change happen that is that, that cannot be survive in one particular place okay environment uh, this are all the one um, what are the factors temperature wind salt and uh, global climate change here another thing we want to know the physical environment limits the abundance and distribution it's it, it can alter the species composition okay uh, it's very important it may uh, they may ask in the uh, optional one because uh, they are providing they are giving the statements possible statement uh, find out the wrong statement that point of view we want to analyze the coins of what is the physical physical environment what is wrong with this statement that is analytical uh, thinking and physical environment limits the abundance and distribution and physical environment it can alter the uh, species composition species composition means here uh, their metabolite production or it may it may be their uh, the generation modulation uh, because uh, in the physical factor uh, if uh, in uh, for example temperature the physical temperature is change means the animal or bat develop their uh, if there is a extreme low temperature now they are uh, uh, they develop their uh, external uh, wools wools are having their uh, external skin uh, furs the fur development that they that fur is protect the animal from the the extreme low temperature that is the composition that species composition is a external parts the uh, their external regions uh, or internal parts all those things are can be changeable that is the physical alteration no sorry physical environment alter the species composition that is composition means it may, it's one example the fur development in animal is for the uh, cooling temperature uh, change in for temperature uh, to survive in the particular temperature like that the animals uh, that plants are developing their leaves okay in sahara the dry land plants are developed their leaves for their water storage that kind of things okay uh, it's uh, uh, high uh, it's uh, uh, natural related on this is a common exam uh, the common introduction it's a specific interaction okay but then warm uh, it's so highly protective environment okay rain forest is there was a physical environment and physical uh, in the different form uh, from very different from environments in the temperature temperate Asia have different temperature Arab world and Europe the, these are all there they are uh, uh, having the various temperature thus the plant product available in this particular areas are different okay the plants also different uh, one plant in india that can't survive in the europe that is the difference so only our medicinal system is very productive so the secondary metabolite production rate is higher in the uh, it's uh, in the asian country plants so only the chinese medicines and uh, traditional medicines are uh, playing a major role in the treatment uh, the, so if this uh, physical environment play a major role because it's a physical envir environment temperature it gives the 
இட் கிவ்ஸ் தி ஃபேவரபிள் நேச்சர் நே ஃபேவரபிள் கண்டிஷன் டு த பிளான் டு ப்ரொடியூஸ் தி செகண்ட்ரி மெட்டபொலைட்ஸ் ஸோ டியூ டு தேட் ஓன்லி தேட் பிளான்ஸ் ஆர் வெரி எஃபெக்டிவ் ஹியர் சம் சம் ஆஃப் த பிளான்ஸ் வெரி த இன் யூரோப் அண்ட் இன் இன் யூரோப் தே வி தே கேன் ப்ரொடியூஸ் த லாங் ட்ரீஸ் த லாங் த ஹையர் பிக் ட்ரீஸ் தட் இட்ஸ் ஹெல்ப் ஃபார் தியர் வுட்டன் பர்பஸ் அண்ட் தேர் தேர் ஹேவிங் ரப்பர் த தேர் ஹேவிங் இன் ஆர் ஏஷியா வி கேன் ப்ரொடியூஸ் ரப்பர் அண்ட் ஸ்பைசிஸ் ஸ்பைஸ் இஸ் த இஸ் நாட் ஏபிள் டு கல்டிவேட் இன் தி யூரோப்ஸ் தட் இஸ் கோல்ட் கண் இன் இன் கோல்ட் கண்ட்ரீஸ் தி கான் கல்டிவேட் தி ஸ்பீ ஸ்பைஸ் ஓகே in the spice uh, in india in asian countries alone producing the spice because that due to the temperature that uh, in that temperature alone the plant can produce the effective product like spice and biotic factor okay here we are all discussed in the earlier uh, class in the what are the biotic uh, uh, factors in that biotic factors um our animals uh, consumers are uh, the first thing is the abiotic chemicals are utilized by the plant that that is produces the plants are produces plant producers are give uh, uh, food to consumers consumers are animals that animals are uh, after the animal decomposition that animal decomposition helpful give the food for bacteria and fungi that fungi and bacteria producing chemicals these are all the uh, interlinked process okay first is the abiotic chemicals that abiotic chemical carbon dioxide oxygen nitrogen minerals this abiotic chemicals help to produce the helps to uh, the plant produces that produces are make using the solar energy and producing the food for consumers consumers are two types then herbivores herbivores and carnivores uh, herbivores means plant eaters and carnivores means animal eaters there's two things uh, the anim- they are consumers consume after uh, consume the food and after some time it, uh, all are they big, all are they died uh, after the death of the animal that uh, their uh, body become uh, decomposed by the bacteria and fungi that fungi and bacteria producing the oxygen carbon dioxide nitrate nitrogen and minerals that is the circulating process okay how the the uh, the on in that is the overall biotic factors involved in the um involved in the, involved in the ecological system here the one point of question is there how the uh, abiotic and biotic become interlinked okay what are all the biotic compound the gas water minerals nutrients heat energy all those things are the uh, abiotic compounds biotic compounds means plants consumers and bacteria so you become the interlink between uh, abiotic and biotic compounds only helpful for the production of the ecology the balancing the ecological system okay it's so one another one example here you can see uh, it's a, a col- um, it's one plant in that plant uh, uh, they they add the abiotic factors that nutrients moisture the, that is this all the abiotic uh, that is no living thing ph aeration temperature the all things are important for the plant growth and also they are providing the positive interaction that positive interaction biotic factor adding the microbes for nitr uh, for the their uh, uh, their root uh, noodles that is the abiotic system the plant having the abiotic system in the plant okay that for nitric nitrogen fixation they are using the microbe in the for uh, in that uh, case that abiotic factor and biotic factors are helpful for make an bio augmentation and bio stimulation natural attenuation so that are make a production of the 
plant uh, the effective plant metabolic production okay next important concept in the ecological system maintenance the habitat and niche habitat we discussed in uh, I, yesterday i am said uh, habitat it's uh, all aspects of area which organism lives uh, there is a place of or the species living here that, that in that particular habitating place they need abiotic factor and also the biotic factor okay these two things are very important for the habitat of animal or uh, organism anything it may be the uh, bacteria it may be the animal and this ecological niche is how species obtain the resource how it get the food that it's a niche uh, it's very important uh, there's a comfortable place to live okay there is a need uh, they they having food they having the environment that is the, uh, the abiotic and biotic factors but niche is how the species obtain this resource it needs for its survival how it is obtained okay uh, habitat means where it uh, species lives which means how it is live within the habitat okay it's uh, one uh, for example page one here uh, it's one kind of animal you may uh, it's sorry it's a pest it's an insect you may uh, seen in many place here uh, here the it's uh, make an uh, uh, dirty rounds with its uh, some it's also habitat for that animal and it's uh, adaptation at that make that makes adaptation here you can see uh, that for for their purpose they capture the uh, uh, that uh, food that place and it's uh, their act here uh, the activity pattern is different okay the physical condition they make the physical conditions also same uh, here in this particular uh, uh, component the, the presence of other organisms also there so it's a habitat so it's having the uh, that its habitat means in that particular thing they having the food they having the uh, uh, their um, abiotic and biotic factors and also how it, how they are uh, get how they are get the uh, they are receiving the food so that is the phys activity pattern the physical condition using their physical condition the period of here uh, very small the period of time during which its activity its organism activity pattern means the period of time during which is activity here it's a active form the resource is obtained from the habitat here it's a uh, having the microbes and uh, nutrition that uh, the uh, this pest it's uh, in insect it's obtained directly from this habitat it's uh, two example of role okay what is the it may be the food it may be the shelter moisture temperature this are the habitat based one and in the niche it's a uh, ecosystem it's a unique way of organism survive okay such as interactions how it is interact with the other organism how it is obtained the food from the shelter to avoid the dangerous and avoids the danger how it is avoids the dangerous here it's a habitat it's a example is a tree field lake and swamp this is the example for the habitat and as a niche it's a anteater anteater is specifically having this protection from their back and also they are maintaining the ant population okay and here the bacteria it's eaten the animals and decomposition doing the decomposition these are all the and it's also helpful for the nitrogen fixation these are like some uh, uh, important thing about the niches because they are uh, maintain they are make a interaction with other organism how they obtain the food these things are very important it's helpful for this pest also decomposition of waste 
uh, everything is interlinked with the ecological system that is uh, if there is uh, decomposition of waste by this pest it is clean the one part particular place that make a uh, uh, helpful for the ecology maintenance and uh, the here the one sorry it's a uh, is the first slide i missed it uh, back to come it's in uh, uh, wrongly it's i'm placed in uh, back of course it's a niche with theory uh, it's in the niche with theory is uh, uh, explained by the hanan and freeman in 1977 and 1988 okay it's a hanan is a specialist and generalist uh, and they both are the specialist and generalist in narrow deep resource exploitation okay versus broad exploitation with some continent capability here i am explain here the uh, in the special specialist okay uh, as in the specialist species okay they are explained with the specialist species uh, is a separate special okay that having different characters different fitness factors all those things are very but the generalist means that um, uh, the curve that species are overlapped that species having the uh, similar characters you can you can see the it can the species can survive with this factors okay, this environment factors variation it's a it's a high for example you take this temperature low it's temperature high species live in temperature high it's a separate one species live in uh, low temperature is a uh, different one but in the comparison this in this uh, theory if they it's a specialist specialist one if the both are are merged that uh, uh, the animal can live in low temperature and also they are live can live in uh, the high temperature that means the generalist the bandwidth is a high uh, do uh, it's a uh, do not shock and uh, they are exam providing the example that is not important it's a bit just with theory and uh, a niche uh, breadth and the width or size uh, some plant and animals are more specialized than others that is the temperature i'm explaining the temperature based one right that maybe they live in high temperature that may be live in low temperature and the measure of niche breadth attempt to quality qualifying this and typically the measure by observing the distribution the distribution is a uh, uh, the population of that the overall count or uh, the how they how which temperature to which temperature they can live of individual organism within the resource state and uh, the resource information of collecting and presented the information is collected and presented in the resource matrix they are collect the information and are plotted in the okay one organism live in this particular temperature oh, okay okay this temperature live in this temperature live in this, this temperature so all those things are uh, marked in this graph and that is the data okay they mention the matrix right that provided the matrix and draw the graph okay it's a overlapping what is overlapping that is the species characterization overlapping okay here uh, we can see the concept called the species can generalist and they that may have relatively high niche overlap compete uh, the compete strongly with other species here the sp oh, species one okay this is the resource rate so resource state means the resource is a temperature pH anything we take the example as a temperature here the low temperature here the high temperature here the for degree for 5 degree here it's a uh, 30 degree it's a so animal level the 35 degree to uh, 30 degree is uh, it can live in the um, okay now we we will take uh, the 5 to uh, 10 okay the only first species one can live in the 5 to 10 but and also the species two can live in the 7 or 9 to 15 that 9 to 12 okay, the species two here 
the species can overlap the species 2 is overlapping the species 1 and also here the you can see the uh, species 3 species 3 can live in the uh, below 10 temperature and also it's uh, from 10 to 20 so the overlapping is uh, happens between both uh, uh, species 1 2 and 3 here the species 1 and 2 are strongly relative species 1 and 3 is as not strongly relative it's a uh, some gap and species 2 and 3 is strongly relative we are providing the image and asking the question based upon the this width okay uh, the distance here the width is the you can measure the uh, the distance between the species and from that place only we can calculate the width okay next is uh, uh, ecological niche in the ecological niche we have two concepts one is the fundamental con niche and another one is the realized niche in the fundamental the niche potentially occupied by the species here you can see it's a uh, um, the value the it's a ocean area it's a two type of uh, uh, shrimps it's a two type it's species one brown color is a species one it's a, a species two they are balancedly occupying the one particular place here the realized niche means it's a portion of fundamental niche the species niche the species species actually occupied uh, here the full species are actually uh, occupied the fundam the full place okay it's a fundamental niche is fully occupied the uh, main concept is fundamental niche means it's a potentially it's fully occupied by the species uh, the realized niche means is a portion of fundamental niche is occupied by the uh, specific specific species actually occupied uh, in another example the potential mode of existence and given the adaptation of the species and realized means its actual mode of existence and its results from the adaptation uh, and competition of other species here it's uh, sorry it's uh, mo it's uh, uh, changed one it's a fundamental niche which is potentially occupied the species are fully occupied it's a fundamental niche sorry these images are wrongly placed the fundamental niche means it's fully occupied species one species is fully occupied it's uh, uh, it's uh, one species in realized means it's fun it's a one species uh, it's so uh, it's a portion of fundamental niche the species actually occupied the one species this uh, brown color species that is the uh, chitta molas here it's molas is the one species uh, this is occupied uh, uh, that place is occupied by the balanas it's like here you can see that's a fundamental is a potential mode of existence that is fully occupied and realized means it's a actual mode of existence that is says its adaptation uh, the another species adapt to the one pl one particular another species two species are can live in the realized niche its difference between two niches are due to the competition and there is no competition in the fundamental in realized there is a competition okay resource uh, partitioning uh, it's a very important thing we may ask the question with the different uh, way okay this uh, black burnian uh, warbler it's a uh, one bird they are eaten the leaves over the tree they can't enter into the tree 
they are placing over the tree and the make up food and black throated here can the see uh, the throat the black throated green warbler here it's they are eaten the the side of the tree the cap may warbler it's a type that species are a uh, same their character alone change the cap may uh, warb warbler they are eaten the top of the leaf of the top leaf of the trees and bay uh, bay breasted warbler uh, they are uh, eaten the uh, in v shape in the v shape eat, eating habits uh, it comes down and comes uh, goes up it go, comes down and goes up and yellow rumped warbler they are eaten the lowest part of the tree it's a very very important concept in the resource partitioning in the resource partitioning uh, it's uh, they are providing the tree and uh, tree type and the eaten habit and they are providing the name we want to find out the answer here it's animals it's another one concept is a resource partitioning here the here you can see the first thing is a black swimmer a size small fish okay uh, at water resource it's a uh, it's a swimmer is uh, it taken the small fishes over the water and um, another thing is a flamingo feed on the uh, minutes organism on the mud okay it's uh, down their head to mud take their food the black swimmer it's taken the surface food the flamingo feed on the uh, uh, it's take a feed on the uh, mud the feed is present in the mud of uh, the head steam low then a uh, second thing here is the scop scop up scop up is uh, uh, driving drug its feed is uh, molu shock it's present from the the sea feeds the sea uh, the lake uh, uh, lake uh, grasses okay the aquatic vegeta vegetation the aquatic vegetation the scop up taken the vegetation so that is a plant eaten then brown pelican they are taken the fish locate from the air okay the fishes are moving over the air from the water to uh, they are jumping in the water that time the brown pelicans are taken the food then uh, louisiana herana they are taken the uh, small fishes in, in mid of the water avocat swap sweeps they are taken the food from also taken from the mud and they are uh, insect and seed eats okay their food is insect and seeds okay then here you can see the dutch chess probe they are taken the food uh, and snail they are taken the snails worms sea worms and snails it's a different the different animals the different birds are taken the different foods the then the herring gull it's a tireless scavenger tireless scavenger they are then the knot it's the sand piper that make a pick the worm and uh, worms from the land here uh, they are searching the small vertebrates in this plant this uh, piping flower their feed is insects the here you can see the resource the all all of them are sea birds but their food is different some on take a water fish some take the f mud insect from mud they are take somebody is taken the vegetate part some take the seeds some take the insect some take the snails some on take the small worms uh, the it's uh, their resources vary then the next important thing in the 
or uh, character displacement how would this character displacement happen this character displacement happen with the competition okay there is a competition between two species means their character are changed their characters become changed because uh, to the, the competition is reduced when two species become more uh, different okay uh, then the an another thing the environmental factor the character displacement uh, here the character displacement in the competing species diverge in the physical character okay it's a they are two species they are in a competition they are having the diverge in the physical characteristics due to the evaluation of retail retired best suited to the resource they are they use in the result from the resourcing partitioning this is also food taken this partitioning is also related with the it is character displacement and the bird that eat a longer seed it's evolved longer larger piles the bird seeds in the smaller seeds they evolve the smaller piles these are the common uh, due to their partitioning they are having their physical character this physical character is displaced uh, depends on their need the partitioning resource partitioning okay this character displacement it's happen in the different pro process this different process are uh, called agonistic sticks ecological and reproductive in the agonistics interact uh, interspecific and interaction competition this is the direct competition okay this direct competition make a shift their uh, and affect their rate intensity outcome of the agonistic interaction between the symbiotic species that is uh, the competition between the same species though there is a uh, effect is uh, affect they are affecting the rate production rate they are affecting the population rate everything the intensity means that population and ecological uh, display uh, based character displacement this ecological based characteristic characteristic characteristics displacement the inter specific exploitative competition that is the in, uh, indirect competition there is no direct there is indirect due to this indirect it's uh, um, it's affect the resource overlapping the resource overlapping means uh, some one food is needed for two species that is a one food one food that is needed for the two food uh, two species means that is a overlapping between the overlapping had happens so this indirect competition avoiding this indirect competition avoiding this uh, that affect the resource overlapping then reproductive is a cross spe species mating it's a it's a cross species mating means is an anti uh, pre psychotic reproductive isolation between the symbiotic species so three type agonistic means it's uh, affect the rate intensity and outcome ecological character displacement affect the resource overlapping and reproductive displacement character displacement it enhance the pre zygotic reproductive isolation this is a very very conceptual one so please understand the concept and some important terms uh, is in the uh, in, uh, previous sessions because uh, upcoming is the uh, interaction fully interaction based one here in this uh, slide this is the role of species play in the ecological in ecosystem difference between habitat and niche we know where it is live is a uh, uh, habitat how would not um, uh, in the niche is not a place it's a I can take the food is fundamental niche means the maximum habitated area 
where the species is a free no interference there is a no extra species only one species that occupy the large place that is a fundamental then realized niche means uh, that is a small hyper volume it's a uh, and one species in hyper volume one species in a lower volume it's a interference that is was the interference of another species and niche overlap in uh, so short uh, sharing the niche among two uh, or more species okay this is a uh, is particular one is a one foot is a whole or oh, it's one foot is taken by the another species niche width means it's a describe the range or dimension occupied by the species that is a width that width that is a band width uh, once again i wish to tell because the, that is the schematic uh, uh, ex, uh, questions are there uh, the width means the overall this population of species the if there is a one species means there is a width here uh, the width is different it's a center part of the curve it's a width another thing the occupying place overlapping it's uh, this resource is utilized by the species to also parish sharing okay next is a type of interactions uh, the uh, this type of interaction is uh, in make a impact on each species and parent uh, parent this uh, the think of interaction the competition the both are uh, that uh, they make that both species are uh, making some side effects make a some effect inter specific and intra specific in inter specific uh, means uh, that may uh, that inter specific also they are playing a competitive one one is a, uh, here you can see that uh, one is a, both are harmed the predict predation in the predation one is uh, harmful another one is not harmful here for example is a plant and animal means predation uh, the predation plant is a positive one it's give a food to animal or, uh, or uh, it's one thing the carnivory ore and uh, herbivory it's a uh, it's a plant herbivory means plant based one carnivory means animal animal eaten and uh, parasitism pathogen and parasitoid here in the common cellism there one will get benefit another is not affect and not benefited mutualism both are beneficial and amensalism one is uh, affected another one is uh, not shown or uh, not get any benefit here uh, the both are getting affected then competition if there is a competition means both are getting affected predation means one will get benefit another will not get benefit it's affect okay in the predation uh, one will affect it one will get benefit common cellism one will get benefit another one is not affected not benefited that is in a neutral form and mutualism one will, both are getting benefit amensolism one will uh, affect it another one is not get benefit but that is neutral is one uh, example in the competition both species are harmful uh, and predation one is benefited and another is harmful mutualism both are benefited commensalism both the, uh, one is benefited one is unaffected that is a zero stage okay uh, here the, the inter specific intra specific competitions also there in the in the inter specific competition means uh, when the competition between same species is a intra species different species means it's a inter species in the inter species competition uh, this is between the species two species the various species is a competition is a different uh, they are for competed for the different resource 
in the ecosystem in the uh, their two species are competitor for the same resource sorry same resource uh, two species are competitor for the same resource in the ecosystem that is the uh, one thing in the interspecific competition and it's it can be violent it uh, if it if the competing species are similar but it is uh, in the another it's a intra species another thing is intra species uh, similar but never strong as the intra specific compila compilation here between the entonomo pathogenic nematodes uh, or nematodes for the uh, lep lepido ternans lava here it's uh, their competition for their resource so example bet in the between the entoma and pathogenic here uh, the for example the nematodes for nematodes are fight for their um, lepito lepito ternodes uh, lavas the here the animals the anim here you can see the ant in ant and uh, the insect interaction that both species are different they are say, interact for the both uh, food the same food they are uh, uh, competent for the uh, food this are the interspecific and interest interest interspecific means uh, different species intra means same species make a interaction for they are competent for uh, one same source Uh, it's another example because uh, uh, in the uh, intra intra specific inter specific inter specific competition uh, there are two populations or uh, when a population of two or more species are coming into community it's rely on this similar limiting resource okay that i am it's a once again repeated one the resource similar species are uh, or uh, for example both animals uh, is, uh, two lions are uh, uh, fighting for one uh, animal one uh, one another species okay that resource the tree lizard niche is a uh, temperate is a temp a temporary is living at the uh, one particular place temp it's all in a particular place the size of tree it's uh, living in it's a uh, uh, it's very important thing they are based on the from that only they are taken the food it's a ecological niche for the inter they are uh, that inter specific comp for the ecological niche they need a location they need a place okay for that the lizard uh, it's fighting with the other species they need uh, they are occupying the environment that is the inter specific competition uh, inter specific competition two different species are fighting for their location also that is a resource and intra specific one species fighting for the uh, same food uh, it's an important concepts is the herbivory uh, herbivores and uh, carnivores herbivores is a plant eaten one uh, here the specialist uh, plant eaten is the colalus colas monarch caterpillars these two things are specifically eat uh, one species they are not um, they that particular species are not uh, eaten by other animals that is the specialist here col uh, colas and uh, monarch uh, caterpillars these two are specialist generalist means uh, in this generalist these cow leaf cater and these are all the uh, generalist because they are eaten all the species that uh, they are these uh, animals are eaten the other uh, species uh, food the degree of feeding specialization is more like than the continuum means the degree is high the species one species eaten by the many animals uh, here the relationship is one animal 
feed on producer okay it's a plant it's a um, interaction between the animal and the producer animal is a consumer producer is a plant the its affect herbivores herbivores can affect both the size and distribution of the plant also and in a com or particular community uh, in the certain plants can survive and grow okay uh, for example uh, in south india you can see the ardhoda plant that plant is in a small uh, its smallest one animals are not eaten the plant because they specifically uh, coats are not uh, eaten that is the ardhoda vasika that is the ardhoda plant and you may see in many plant that many places that cannot eatable by their uh, coats because in particular period that coats are the most animals so they are developing the metabolites against the uh, coats goats uh, uh, that goats are uh, not eaten the plant so that survive in a particular place so they are they are developing their character replace their character they are develop their uh, uh, metabolites for uh, to against the uh, species the, the another species they are uh, consumers uh, it's a uh, example the one thing the distribution also affect and another thing is uh, they can develop their uh, capability to survive and grow it's a carnivore predation in the carnivore predation the, uh, the, the lion and zebra it's a thing uh, the zebra is a prey lions are predators um, that uh, uh, zebras are harmed by the or uh, lions this is the uh, very uh, most example likewise some of the examples also available in the uh, uh, in this concept the carnivore predation and herbivore predation then pollination in the pollination uh, some of the animals are involved in the pollinator pollination uh, that they plant that flowers are not able to pollinate with the air or in that nature so that uh, animals the bees are like a pollinator this pollination uh, they are taken the they are at the pol pollens are attached to their body parts of the pollinator and they are uh, that is released in the another flower and that uh, uh, make a uh, sense with the fruits and make up fruit and other things these are all the pollinations religion okay then these are all the uh, concept with uh, new uh, they call their uh, really interaction between the uh, uh, the nature that consumers and predator here they can see the uh, the consumer and predator interaction here uh, this is also a consumer predator interaction interaction that uh, sorry consumer and producer interactions okay uh, and then another interaction is a symbiosis in this symbiosis relationship two or more species are closely together live together uh, live in a th they th that in that type three uh, interactions of they mutualism commensalism and uh, other parasitism here you can see the mutualism on species also two species also benefited uh it's a uh, it's uh, one animal is another animal both are living together and it's both are getting benefit here you can see in the commensalism one will get benefit that is say uh, it's living in the shadow but it's uh, you uh, by by this uh, way of uh, uh, living this animal it's not getting affected that is also in the neutral form that is not get affect that will not get benefit and parasitism okay it's a very dangerous one that animal living on the one particular species that make a uh, interaction with and affect uh, getting the food from one species and it's affect the one animal red eggs affected one the green is benefited one so okay these are all the things all about the uh, concepts in the interactions tomorrow we will discuss some other topics in the uh, 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 remaining unit If you have any queries, please put it in chat box.
yeah it's a butterfly species okay you are explaining uh, thank you thank you ma'am oh, thank you sir uh we are explaining this concept which concept yeah Inter the interspecies competition they explain in the concept that it's, it's at the lava stage okay um thank you everyone i'm in this session live uh, tomorrow we will discuss about the remaining part of uh, the unit 10 Example for resource partitioning is uh, most widely they are discussing the uh, this uh, pond uh, birds. Okay, how they different different uh, location, different animal eating. Some some plants are taken the food from mud. Some 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 birds are taken the food from mud. Some plants are some birds are taken uh, pond plants grasses. I'll check the extra. Com uh, extra examples because uh, during my search uh, I most repeatedly found this uh, bird related bird uh, birds are eat the tree location the eating part of uh, parting parts on the tree that is the first example these two things are most widely I am seen in the um, search uh, I'll check and let you know uh, the uh, concept where extra animals are there now this uh, these two uh, things are most widely uh, present as uh, 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 found in the resource Anolis aware money is another example for resource partition. Okay, thank you. Yeah, okay, okay. I found it. I'll send the that image in also in uh, PPT, ma'am.
Okay, thank you everyone. Uh, thank you for your replies. Um, now I am in this session. Thank you.